Welcome to Icing TV. My name's Janelle from Enticing Icing Cake Design. Today we're going to show you how to put an edible image on a cake. Let's get started. The first thing we need to do in order to put the image on top of the cake is to cut ourselves out a template. So what we need to do is get a large piece of baking paper, like your cake tin over the top of it, just cut it out so you've piece of baking paper is the same size as your tin. Now the reason why we do that is so when we put our image on, we can actually center the baking paper over the top of the image just to make sure we've got it um, exactly centered before we cut it out because once we cut it out that's it, it's cut out. So now that we've got that centered, just with a pencil go around the edge of the image and draw a line. Now um, it's fine to use a pencil because what you're actually going to do is cut in ever so slightly about another five mil to a centimetre in further from that line that you've drawn and then we'll put the image on top of the cake. Now before we put the image on the cake what we need to do is crumb coat the cake. So I've just got some pre-made buttercream here. It doesn't have to be neat, it just has to be on there. When we pipe around the edge what we find is Piping won't stick to the cake unless you've crumb coated it first. Now we just want to put a little bit of icing on the top. We want the top of the cake to be as smooth as possible uh, before we put the image on because anywhere where there is a line the cake can actually hold air bubbles there. What I often do, that's pretty smooth I will say, but what I often do is I get a really long spatula, I heat it up underneath the tap and drag it along the top of the cake, perfectly smooth. So now what we do is we take the plastic coating sheet off the back of the uh, image. Okay, so we're going to lower the image onto the cake. We want to hold the image at this angle and lower it very carefully with the sides up. The reason why we want to do it with the sides up is so we can make sure one that it's in the center and two we're going to put a piece of baking paper over the top of the cake and smooth it over and we want to reduce the quantity of air bubbles we're going to have and if you enter it from the center first and then work your way out that's great. Now you can smooth this with your hand. I prefer to use a fondant smoother just you want to get the air bubbles out now because I will say later on uh, when the edible image softens in the fridge you'll find that if you don't get them out now it'll be really really noticeable. So now all we have to do is pipe around the edge of the cake. So in order to do the piping there's a couple of different ways to finish it. You can put little rosettes around the side of the cake and we do have a video on that. You can see the link below for that or all you have to do if you just want a star quick finish Squeeze the piping bag on the side of the cake, stop squeezing and then pull back. Squeeze, stop squeezing and pull back all the way around the cake. If you don't stop squeezing at the right time, the um, frosting will stretch all the way out past here onto your turntable. So we'll do that all the way around the edge of the cake. Okay, so we've piped all the way around the edge of the cake. Now we want to pipe around the very join here where the image meets the rest of the frosting and all we do is put a little star right on the edge making sure it covers the image itself. That's our cake finished. If you'd like to see another video on how to fill a piping bag an easy way or if you'd like to see one on making buttercream or how to do rosettes on the side of a cake see the link below. Visit our online shop for the products used in this video, we post Australia wide. Like this video and subscribe to our YouTube channel for a much wider range of videos. New videos are posted every Sunday night at 7.30 Australian Eastern Standard Time. Follow us on Facebook for cake decorating specials, upcoming offline cake decorating classes and newly released cake in a box cake kits, not to mention the next cake club kit of the month. Thanks for watching.